Good morning! My regular mental breakdown was scheduled right now and then I remembered that I actually did went thrifting the other month and I still have a bunch of clothes that I thrifted so I just decided that we're gonna do that instead. So if you're wondering where I go thrifting, I've actually mentioned this before, but I do thrift in Cabanatuan City, which is my mom's hometown, and I also get the clothes altered there. So do not get the wrong impression, the clothes I thrifted had to be altered. They usually do not fit me perfectly, and that's, you know, most of the time, which is I guess is a con in thrifting, but I honestly don't mind because I think of it as supporting local tailors in my country. So the first item that we got are these sort of blue navy type of shorts and these are actually a little too long so I did have to fold them so I might get them altered again and I do apologize in advance for all the dancing that I will be doing in this video. Um, I do not know why I did that so yeah we have that. Also I really like these because pockets that is all I can say. So I do pair this with sort of a white knit top and a denim jacket, both of which I actually thrifted I think two years ago, but in a different location. The next item that we got is a really simple sort of t-shirt and it has penguins in front of it as a design. And I love penguins. Uh, they are just so adorable. I love the fabric of this one. I do not know why I'm petting the penguin, um, but I just really love this t-shirt. And surprise, surprise, we have another t-shirt because uh, I'm sorry, I cannot get any more basic than this, but I'm running out of t-shirts and I like this one. It says ladies who launch and I also pair it both of them with the denim shorts that I thrifted a while back. Now this one was actually initially a vest, but I did ask the tailor to remove the collar because it wasn't really my vibe and I love how this turned out. I do not know what's going on here, but this is not something I would usually wear, but I just like pairing it. The next piece of clothing that we got is actually inspired by Kira Knightley's Begin Again. I love that film. I love her vibe. I love her outfits. So I saw this sort of polo button up whatever, but it was long sleeve. So I just removed the sleeves, you know, it's a possibility. And here's me trying to pretend I'm her, but I'm not her. The next thing that we got is this really simple sort of button up polo shirt. Um, It's very, I don't, I, I think it's knit, but it's not really. I love the details. I love the patterns and the texture of this one. And again, we have two pockets. What more can I say? I love this so much. And I pair this with white jeans that I got Again, from a different location, but I thrifted it. Up next, we have a sort of polo shirt and Levi's jeans combination. I love the pants. They're actually real Levi's, and I got them for really cheap compared to other thrift stores. And this polo shirt, I don't know if you can see up clear, but it actually has a really nice pattern and texture to it. So, you know, we have that. And up next is a sweater vest. Um, I'm so sorry, I'm just trying to go with whatever Pinterest shows me and apparently sweater vests are a thing right now. So I, I just had to have one. I actually got this from a Japanese surplus, which is kind of weird. And again, it was long sleeve, but I just asked the tailor to remove the sleeve and it was turtleneck. But then I also just asked the tailor to make it a shorter neck, which I didn't know was a possibility, but he made it happen. And again, we have another Thing that looks similar to the Kira Knightley outfit, but this one is also just a sweater vest and it's very plain and simple. Uh, this one didn't really need much alterations apart from just cutting it out a little bit because it was kind of too long. I just paired it with my white pants that I again thrifted two years ago and this trench coat that I could never wear outside because again, I live in a tropical country and you know, I mean, do whatever makes you happy. Lastly, we have this really beautiful, gorgeous dress, but this is not thrifted. But at the location where we get our clothes thrifted, there's actually a seamstress. But I guess the moral of the story is you can actually get clothes made in your local public market. So who would have thunk? Thank you everyone for watching. Thanks for sticking around and allowing me to take my mind off my 
regular mental breakdown. So I appreciate that a lot. And I love y'all from the bottom of my hypothalamus which is in your brain, and do get vaccinated. I, I don't know what else to say, uh, so I bid you farewell.